Hello everyone, hope everything is fine and everyone is safe and good. In this tutorial we are going to learn how to model any shape we want from an image with a few steps in 3ds Max. So let's start. Okay, first of all we're gonna create a plane just like that and increase the segments let's say 500 by 500 okay now uh, we will get the image we want let's say I'll start with Starbucks logo I'll drag it and drop it here on the plane and I'll fix the UVW map just like that by bitmap fit and I'll choose this image and I'll get the correct UVW for the uh, image and I rescale the plane just like that okay after that we will add displacement or displace comment just like this and we'll increase the strength and I'll drag the bitmap the same bit bitmap to here so I'll get this and I'll make so we can see I'll increase the strength a little bit we can see that the bitmap is extruded but we will we have to choose this option use existing mapping okay and I'll increase it a little bit more just like that okay now from shapes we will use section command to make a section for the drawing by the way to know more about section section command go to the link up here in the corner and you'll see a video I made previously talking about the section command on my channel so I will go to top view and I'll draw a section just like that and from front or left I'll put it in the middle you can see I'm hiding the geometry you can see that the section draw uh, an aspect line for the model we made and from here I will make create shape I'll press ok and I'll delete everything now I have the SP lines of the logo that I want so I'll give it and comment SP line relax just like this and I'll increase we can see the notes here this command will make our curves more smoother so I'll increase it to 1 and increase this let's say to 5 3 I think it's fine and I'll give it a, a optimize optimize SP line from the notes here we can see that the SP line have a huge number of uh, vertex so I'll reduce the vertex by the percent let's say 95 percent and we'll have this result okay after that I'll try to clean up some unnecessary points or unnecessary elements by deleting them just like this and I'll extrude it let's say for five centimeter and that's it I have my model ready just from an image without tracing it without any effort we have a fine shape for our logo I repeat this way on another elements to see that we can make this shape 
or any 3D shape we want just from an JPEG or PNG image. I'll go here, I'll get the Batman logo and I'll give it this place and I'll change the UVW first bitman fit this I rescale the plane just like that okay I'll add strength I'll drag this to here and I'll choose don't forget to use existing mapping okay now from shapes I'll create a section just like this and from here I'll create shape then I'll delete this and this and now I have the shape of the Batman logo okay I repeat the comments we made I'll go to spline relax go to one and that's fine I'll go to optimize the spline just like that and I will reduce the knots or the vertex by 95% just like that then I can extrude it easily I can make or we can not extrude it from here we can give it a bevel comment okay from here I will give it a height of 2 cm let's say I'll give it another height for half and make an outline to make a bevel just like this and here's the Batman logo let's move it to here I'll make it on another image this time will be a fingerprint just like that I'll fix the UVW map by bitmap fit just like this and I'll go to this place and I'll increase the strength I'll drag the image to bitmap just like this and don't forget to use existing mapping okay now I will create a section from shapes like this just to check okay this is the fingerprint and I'll make a create shape okay I will delete the plane and the section okay and as usual we will give it a spline relax from here and that's perfect and we'll give it a optimized spline you can see the huge number of vertex here so I'll reduce it by 95 that's awesome okay now we can make an extrude for it just like this and now and now we have the fingerprint modeled perfectly and that's all so show me your results tag me any place you want hope you enjoyed it hope it was a uh, new information you learned and thank you very much for watching please leave like and comment in the comment box and see you next time goodbye